Hey everyone, and uh... Wow, it really has been over 9 months since I actually talked in a video, huh? But uh, yeah, I guess welcome to the 3rd annual birthday Q&A. Okay, y'all already know how this works, so I'm just gonna stop wasting time and get on with it. What are your thoughts on cheese graters? While they don't do very much outside of what the name implies, the fact that not many other things can grate cheese is what contributes to the cheese graters' valuable niche in the kitchen metagame, in my opinion. If you had the ability to wipe sands from everyone's memory, would you do it? Now, as tempting as this sounds, the problem is that even if I did successfully wipe sands from everyone's memory, the Undertale would still exist, and so would every single fan art and meme of sands would still exist, and people would quickly, like, remember who Sans is, so my efforts would just go to waste in the end. Unless this implies that everything Sans related also gets erased along with people's memories. And if that's the case, then, uh, yeah, I'd, I'd probably do it. It's for the best. So, like, what is your guilty pleasure fetish, and have you been secretly in disguise my childhood hero Tony Hawk this entire time? Wow, those are two very different questions. Well, as for the first one... And as for the second one, no, and unfortunately I'm not Tony Hawk. How does it feel to be free from the mortal limitations of not being an adult? Honestly, I feel no different at all. But I'm sure that'll change. Sans is in Smash now, why haven't you deleted your channel yet? He's not in the game, he's just a me costume. Will you ever make good content? No. Hi Jonah, how's your day going? Good. Pretty good. Who's <laughs> Joe? Because somebody's already asked, who's Joe, I must ask, who is Nah? Shit, I don't know. Will Dad ever come home from the store with the milk? Now that's a question I've been wondering my entire life. What is your preferred method of walking upstairs? One, two, three stairs at a time, going quadrupled, falling upwards, etc. Honestly, it really depends on the day. Falling upwards can be really quick and convenient, but it's pretty difficult to do if you're, like, say, carrying a lot of things. Plus, it requires immense optimization to be able to get it consistently, so most of the time, I just do one step at a time. Why do you have so many bones in your basement? Because it's fucking October? Where are the bones in your basement, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. Will you ever play Fire Emblem? I don't know, maybe. Guess I could, like, stream one one day or something if you guys want. Mm hmm. How much milk do you drink in a day? Honestly, since I've been at college, I've drinking exactly zero milk. Vibe check. Are you ready for the feeling of existential dread that will now loom over you for the rest of your life? Yep. Matter of fact, I've been feeling that for a month already. Sorry if this has been asked before, but have you ever considered a project like Garbage in the Future for Ultimate? As a matter of fact, yeah, it's been something I've been wanting to do for a while now. But like, currently, as far as I know, switch modding is still like really not safe and like, risk for being banned and I'd rather not want to do that, so I don't know, until like online switch modding becomes like a thing or more safe, then yeah, I'm probably just gonna lay well off of that. How's life so far from high school versus college? It's weird, like I feel like there's like less work but also a lot more work at the same time. Plus I've noticed I've had a lot more time on my hands just to do whatever. But uh, overall I feel fine. Yeah, I do miss my friends from home, but we still talk on Discord and whatnot. Who do you hope the final characters for Smash are going to be? Honestly, I really don't have any character that I, like, super want to get in. Like, I'm, like, satisfied with what there is now, but... As for, like, the final characters, I just want to be, like, surprised, you know? Yeah, I was, like, really hyped when Ridley was shut off, but... Plant just made me lose my fucking mind, because I... There is no way I would have ever expected that to happen. And I just want more things that'll uh, make me go into shock or something. What do you think of Sans technically being in Smash Bros? Damn, even like a month after the reveal, it's still fucking crazy. Like, I actually screamed when they showed him on the screen. It was like, it didn't even look like a costume. The, the model was so well made, I thought it was actually him for a second and... Earlier, I know that I said that I wanted to be surprised by the Final Smash characters, but honestly, I don't know if anything could surprise me as much as that did. Would you consider doing a Rivals of Aether video with me and doing Workshop and other things? Yeah. If you could add any track to Garbage Lilat's amazing music selection, what would it be? Okay, for like the 98% of you who don't understand what he's talking about, while I was still making Garbage, I made the music list for Lilat very, um, unique. 
as you can see on the screen. And if I could add anything to that, uh, it would probably be... I guess I'd add Yul Cowards Don't Even Smoke Crack. When is next upload, and also, what do you are have another time since then again? Asking for a friend. In about three. How much do you love the Mother series? A lot. If you starred in a video game, what would it be like? Fucking boring and lame. Do Japanese people watch American cartoons dubbed in Japanese or with Japanese subtitles? I don't know, but there probably are heated debates about which is the better option. Okay, so I'm wondering. Yeah, me too. Will you be starting a feed pick Patreon now that you legally can? N no. May I see your feet? No! John, what's 9 plus 10? 910, you fucking retard. Do you find 69 to be the peak of human comedy? No. That title would have to go to- Foreskin. How do you drink water? Do you gulp it all at once, or do you to sip it very slowly to get the full water experience? I usually do multiple small to medium sized gulps at a time to try and maximize the amount of water I can get without having to empty the entire thing in one go. Gonna change your YouTube bio? Honestly, I completely forgot about it, and I just realized that I haven't changed it like a week or two ago, and I was gonna change it, but then I realized that December is less than two months away, and it's almost the thirstiest time of the year again, so I'm just gonna leave it up. Are you going to play Nekopara? No! Are you happy with your hellhole of a server? Yeah, I am. A couple months after I first made it, I was beginning to think, God, I should not have done this. This was a mistake. But over time, it's gotten better, and I can honestly say that I'm pretty content with how it is right now. Is it perfect? <laughs> no. But that's okay. I'm glad that it's still going after two years. Wow. So to all of you who have still been active in the server after all this time, or are active now and joined a little later, thanks. Well, I guess we're ending this one on a bit of a softer note. But yeah, I guess that's the end of this year's Q&A. So, uh, thanks for commenting and shit and asking questions. And I'm gonna have something special going up on here very soon. And this time I actually mean soon. But, uh, yeah, until then, uh, see ya. I'm gonna go eat a Pringle or something. Wait, wait, stop the outro! <sighs> I think I missed a question. <clears throat> From the period 2008 to 2016, Obama served as the President of the United States of America. Develop an argument that evaluates the identity of Obama's last name. Your response should include a defensible thesis, specific evidence from Obama's presidency, and context related to a broader historical perspective relevant to the prompt. Okay, let's start with the basics. Many people would have you think that Obama's last name is Kerr, but this, my friends, isn't the case. How do I know this? Well, by simply going to howmanyofme.com, we can clearly see that zero people in the United States have care as their last name. So then, what really is Obama's last name? To find this, we're going to have to dig a little deeper. Let's start at this quote from Obama saying, My fellow Americans, we are and always will be a nation of immigrants. We were strangers once too. Notice the use of the word strangers. Does it ring any bells? It should. In Rick Astley's song from 1987 titled, Never Gonna Give You Up, the third word said is, you guessed it, strangers. Upon further inspection, we can see that it being the exactly third word spoken is no mere coincidence. The number three is very special, you see. There are three sides to a triangle and, yeah, you know where this is headed. What is to find by its triangular shape? That's right, obamium. Obamium is, of course, a three-dimensional substance, which means that it forms a triangular prism, which has four triangular sides, one rectangular side, and eight edges. Three times four times eight equals 96. Swap the numbers, and you, of course, get 69. Divide that by 3.8333, and you get approximately 18. As we all know, there are exactly 18 naked cowboys in the showers of Ram Ranch at any given moment, and the fact that we've circled the Ram Ranch can only mean one thing. Obama was once a cowboy at Ram Ranch at some point in his life. During his time there, in addition to wanting to suck big, hard, throbbing cowboy cocks, there is a slight possibility that he had at one point taken a horse's dick, making him a furry. And with that final conclusion, and all the evidence we've gathered so far, we can finally solve the mystery of his last name. Between Obamium, Horsecock, and all of the ties to the number three, it all adds up to this. The true identity of Obama's last name is...